beautiful, wonderful people of the internet? You are watching Amethyst Budgets, and I am the Amethyst in question. Welcome here. Over on this channel, we are stressed but blessed. We are low income, working on building ourselves up to the next tax, tax bracket by being self-employed, doing gig work. I am currently working on becoming a full-time um, clothing reseller. It is a slow and painful journey, but I'm getting there. Those of you who know, you know, I am just trying to be better about scheduling and all the jazz and just making more money. So I did do a plan with me video where I break down why I'm doing everything I'm doing here. Um, the only thing I didn't do was checking denominations and stuff. So if there is a little cash symbol next to something, that means it is getting stuffed with real cash. If there's a little O, that means that it is staying online. That represents the money that is online for my bills. All of my bills currently are being paid online. Eventually I'd like to transfer them over to credit cards so that I can get a little bit of that cash back bonus and then I just pay them off in cash at the end of each month. That's the ultimate goal but for right now I'm still stuck on online because I don't trust myself enough with credit cards. I've had a lot going on. I talked in my last video about my issue with my tooth and um some other things here and there. Today's video, because it is cash stuffing, they tend to be longer, so I'm not gonna do too much talking. Let's just get straight into it. Actually, no, I'm not getting straight into it. These gorgeous, beautiful, amazing nails are by the wonderful Ballerina and Stilettos over on Etsy. You can check out her shop. She's got tons of different designs. I absolutely love these. I feel so fancy in them. And then she's also got these designs too, which you can um, expect to see on my channel in the future. So I'm, I'm very much in love with them. They last a very long time, and I really, really love her sets. So I'm going to kind of shift everything around so we can get into today's video. What I really wanted to do was to have everything get stuffed with at least a dollar. I didn't quite get there, but everything is looking pretty decent. So we're getting into my honey pot. This is like my fun, um, fun things that I like stuffing basically. Um, and my cash tray is new. I got it from Budget with Free um, and her Etsy shop is Crafted by Free. So my pet envelope is getting a dollar. This is for my three pet rats. So, and let's do a little county with it. So we got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, um, sixteen, twenty-six. God, these bills are so grody right now. So very gross. These ones were not supposed to stay in my account. I was expecting to spend that money much faster than I have. Um, yeah, I wonder if there's a way that I can get rid of this glare. I am using artificial light today. I usually don't. I usually use um, um, natural light. So business is getting a dollar. This one is actually not supposed to be in the honey pot. This is supposed to be in the controller binder, which is all of my bills. But uh, for some reason, it snuck its way into this one, and I just keep forgetting to change it. YouTube is getting a dollar. This is for the giveaway that I'm hosting. You can check it out in the cards button. It now has $16. This is going for shipping, supplies, stuff like that. One of the prizes I am shopping for one of you guys, so um, that is going to go towards there. I definitely am going to have to bulk that up next week. Um, home is getting $20 online, and I'm going to do it in a t in two tens because this money is for my home security system, which is $10 a month, and then I also need toilet paper. And I buy bulk. Um, the last time I bought, bought toilet paper was actually in January of last of this year. So like I buy a lot at once, and it's just me living here, so I don't go through it that much. Um, I get it at Walmart. It seems to be the cheapest. Unfortunately, I'm not going to be stuffing at PNC. It has currently, I think that is $10 in there. Did I say PNC or PC? I don't know. This is for my uh, gaming laptop that I'm trying to save up for right now. Medical is getting $10. And I'm just going to take this tracker out because I've just not been keeping up with it. Also, whatever ink they used at UPS is doing this. So that's super frustrating and I'm going to have to figure out a way around that. Um, it's getting $10. Oops. And then my car, this is technically a savings challenge, so I guess I'm just going to color that in real quick. I'm going to need an oil change, and I didn't even know I had this money in here. What the what? <laughs> I didn't even know I had cash in here. So that's cool. So I'm going to add this. I think each icon was supposed to be $5, and obviously I have not been keeping up with this one, but I'm just going to um, messily color these in here. 
So that's five and 10. And these savings challenges that you're seeing here or saving trackers, whatever you want to call them, they are available on my Etsy. You can buy them in bundle or um, individually and you can get them in color or black and white. And they are, I think $1.50 if I'm not mistaken. So we got $30 in a car. Maybe if it'll go in. My cash packing skills have not been it today. So that's awesome because that means I can now schedule my oil change. My oil changes are not that expensive and I'm going to a local place that um, honors a Groupon price that they have. Um, and then my Cricut savings challenge is getting a dollar. I'm not sure how to do this. Okay, I'm going to, in order to represent that it's like not been colored in, I'm just going to fold it up and put it in the front here. This is to pay off my Cricut. I do own my Cricut, and guys, would you believe that I haven't even used it yet? I have done an unboxing video, so that is going to be on my second channel. If you're interested in seeing my second channel, it's linked down below. Um, but I haven't actually used it yet, so that's kind of crazy to me. So Samsung is getting another dollar, so it has two. And my Samsung is online, so when I'm properly budgeting for this, I usually budget it online. Um, but I was just trying to get money in as many spots as I could, and I know that if I do a dollar online, that I'm going to spend that dollar. Um, I don't know why it's like that in my head, but if it's not a proper bill, then I just spend the money. So I'm trying to get away from doing online spend or online budgeting as much as possible. I don't believe anything in here is getting stuffed. Yeah, actually. This is my savings challenge binder, so it doesn't really get stuffed that often, being low income. Um, let's get into my controller binder, which is very thin. <laughs> so Wi-Fi is going to be getting $20. Everything is out of order, unfortunately, right now. So it has $25, which is how much my Wi-Fi is per month, and this bill is coming out this week. I'm not sure when you guys are going to see this video. I honestly am filming it way earlier than I need to but I had the means, so I am doing it. Um, rent is getting $67, which is hurtful, to be honest. So we have two, four, six, eight already, adding, I know I'm gonna do a bill swap, so actually, why don't I just do this? So I have 80 plus 67 is 147, so I'm gonna just put these 20s back and pull out one, two, four, five, six, seven. And that means that I need to earn all of my rent money next week. It's whatever. <laughs> I'm used to it at this point. Um, but I did do better in terms of earnings this week, so if I can keep up. Okay, my rats are playing and they made a noise. <laughs> so if I can keep up this week with my schedule, then I should be golden by the end of the week. Um, that is if I'm not going to get a an emergency root canal, um, which I talked about in my budget with me video. So if you're interested in hearing about that, then definitely check that video out. This is electric and it is getting $50. So my electric did go up this month, which I knew it would. I knew that $30 price mark was way too good to be true. It's looking like it's going to be around $80 next month, but guys, it has been in the 90s every single day this past month. So I'm mad about it, but I can't be too mad about it, you know? Health insurance is getting $40. This is also coming out this month, this week. So it is going to have $45. Now, if I was better about saving up little by little for my bills and stuff, then this obviously wouldn't be a problem with my whole rent. Like, I'm spending so much on bills that are due this week um, that I could be so much better off if I just had been smarter about that, you know? Um, subscriptions. I don't... Where did I see that envelope? Okay, my subscriptions envelope is floating around somewhere. It is getting $12 for Spotify. If I do this, I, I know I'm gonna know what it is for. Watch me actually forget, but I'm just gonna put it there. So that's for subscriptions. That is online. Um, taxes is getting $95. And I did do a condensing of this in my last video. So I have two 500 placeholders here. I do make these placeholders that you're seeing in the video. So if you're interested in them, definitely uh, check out my Etsy shop. So here I have 40 plus 95. 
which is 135. So again, putting this back, I'm gonna do 120, 35, just to make it easier on myself. And because I find that I'm running out of these like fake bills, so not fully running out, but running out of like the, the nice ones. Like I have these ones and then I have these ones and I don't like using these ones. Okay. And that means I have no clue what that is in my taxes account. Okay, now these ones are all gonna be getting dollars. So insurance, I pay for my car insurance every six months. My next payment should be in, I think, November, if I'm not mistaken. So I need to make sure that I am saving up better. My phone plan, I also got six months worth of phone bills. So that next payment is coming up in January. And these dollars are so gross, but whatever. Annual, I have a bunch of annual subscriptions. I want to create an annual binder, um, so I might do that sometime in the future. Like have a binder dedicated all towards annual payments and stuff, because that would probably help keep me on track. Um, food and gas are staying online. And then the last two dollars here are going towards my debt accounts. And I do have my Amazon credit card and my Chase credit card, um, but those two envelopes are, are currently not with me. They're in my purse downstairs. So um, we are not going to be stuffing those ones on camera today. Um, yeah, I think that's it for today's video, right? Did I do it all? And in less than 15 minutes, <laughs> um, while I can remember, don't forget to check out the BCL links this week. Um, I am not, I'm, uh, but when I'm filming my videos, I'm not always sure who is going to be um, shouted out in that week. Does that make sense? So I have a hard time keeping track with everything, I'm not going to lie. Um, but I will leave them on the screen here so that you guys can go check them out. I'll leave them in the comment section down below so it's easy to click on their links and subscribe. Show some girls some support. So yeah, that is all for today's video. If you are still here, leave me a drink emoji, whatever drink there is. I'm sure there's some, there's got to be like a soda or a coffee or tea or something. So just whatever you want to link and are put for the emoji, do that. And if you're hearing this message, that means that I'm talking to you. Yes, you as your individual self. Um, thank you so much for watching my video. I genuinely am so grateful for this community and for you and for your view. Your view counts in my eyes. Um, the ads that you watch at the beginning are making me money. So that is absolutely incredible. I'm so very grateful. And um, yeah, I, I don't think I'll ever be able to fully... Uh, tell you guys how much you mean to me, but I'm going to try as much as possible. Y'all mean uh, so much to me. So thank you so much. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. I really appreciate each and every single one of you. Um, again, I wonder how many times I can say that before I actually finish the intro. <laughs> Anywho, I will see you guys in the next one. Bye.